All right, Shalom. Shalom. The GMS New Orleans Convention, another lesson. As we always do, we want to start off by giving an infinite honor to give uh, uh, praises to you. How will you go by Shem Yahushai by the Shem Yahushai? Once again, double honor to the elders, apostles of GMS, peace and blessing and salutation. Once again, to the hopeful elect and to, to the sincere out there that's following after the Lamb Yahushai. Right. And this lesson here is kind of, um, it's kind of like a spinoff from what the other brothers are doing. Um, I believe the Lafayette, Lafayette brothers or the Baton Rouge brothers, because I was already in the mood of going into the, to the solar eclipse, the, the earthquakes, and things that are happening, all right, the, the current events, all right, of this present time, all right? And seeing that this, this, this uh, solar eclipse is coming, all right, is another telltale sign of what? All right, the Lord is giving, giving the men of the Lord signs of the end. Right, because a couple of, what two years ago, I think we prophesied that the first uh, solar eclipse was going to make a, a, another direction. I think what uh, east to west. Now this one making a, a full blown X from east uh, west to east, man. All right, and, and it's putting a, a full blown X on America, Xing it out, man. All right, is another. It's, these are the signs of the times of, of the Lord prophesied and told us from the end what's going to happen. And now what's happening, what's been happening too? Earthquakes, man. You heard earthquakes in uh, Taiwan. New York. Yeah, earthquakes in New York. And this Jersey. is, in the, yeah, Jersey. And this in the last three months, if you go look up the last earthquakes in the last three months, it's been happening all in the South, all in Texas, and various other places. They just don't put it out there as much, all right, as it being a major 7.0, uh, 8, 8.0 off the Richter, you know, off the Richter scale, all right? But we in the times, the Lord prophesied these things gonna happen, all right? Blood moons, and you know, we know those are things are synonymous with what? War, war is coming, man. All right, bloodshed is coming at an all-time high. So give me that. Give me that. What I, what I told you. You can get your preset right after that. Just read the. Uh, just read the first verse and then you get your preset. We gotta read it again. God, this is Second Esther <laughs> chapter nine, verse one. He answered me then and said. Measure thou the time diligently in itself. And how we, what, what tool did we use to measure the times? What instrument or what uh, uh, measure or, or rod that we use to measure the time, the sign of the times? This Bible, man. This Bible has everything that you need front to back on knowing the, the time frame of times that we're in. And it, and it, and it tells, tells through prophecy that we are in the end. All right? And the Lord has given the men of the Lord. In the, in the in the in the to see that follow after you, I should have given them signs and clues on on to tell how close we are to the uh, the very end. All right, <clears throat> and he, he's going to read read it again. He answered me then and said, "Measure thou the time diligently in itself with the Bible." Go ahead. And when thou seest part of the signs past, which I have told thee before, <clears throat> and get Matthew twenty four. All right, but go ahead. It's on time. Verse two. Then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. And he got it too. And the Lord tell you how he visits the world. This world, this present world that we live in, all right? This this realm, the Lord visited in the way of certain things, all right? Uh, Isaiah 29 and 6. All right, but get your precept real fast so we, we can uh, bounce around. You hey, know? It plays right into that Matthew 24 and the second Esther chapter 9. This is Luke 21 and 25. I got that. I'm more than that. Okay, yeah. let me get that. <laughs> 21 and 25. Yes, there yes. shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars. It should be what? Signs in the sun okay. and in the moon. What's, what's coming What's coming in Monday? A solar eclipse. That's when you have what? The uh, the moon and the, I think the moon and the, the moon and the sun arise. In the, in the, in the, uh, the sun, I think it blocks out the, the moon. Yeah, it blocks out the moon, and it has a, this black aura to it, you know? Yeah, the moon block out the sun. All right? And it shows forth this, this black this ring around, around it, man. Something that, you know, all, all nations, which the Lord tell you in uh, Jeremiah the 10th chapter. Read it real fast. I got it. Yeah, it's yeah. It. Jeremiah 10. I got that Jeremiah. They just made at the signs of yeah. heaven. Yeah, these heathens are just made at it. So you you bet your bottom dollar, you come outside when the solar eclipse is going on, you're going to see all nations, Moabites, 
uh, instrument like they just gonna be looking up. Yeah. People had them dumb ass 3D glasses on. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, baby, who you looking at? Oh my god, no little homie got. <laughs> <laughs> I can't keep getting it out of my head, man. My little lug nut. My little lug nut. I can't get it out of my head, you know? But they're going to be up there looking at the. And yeah, one nigga, he, he didn't got blind looking at. They told him, don't look at him like that. He still look at the damn sun with nothing on, man. You know? What you about to say? Another woman, she was blind for like six weeks. She just saw a black spot in the middle of her yeah. eyesight, huh? Yeah. You, you also had the hard fish. Well, uh, like yeah, yeah, like three hundred ladies. Come on, brother. You also had an article. Yeah, you got that brother been talking about. You got an article where uh, the government was trying to hire scientists to basically trap or uh, track the sun doing the solar eclipse, man. Right. Which that ain't even the logic of that, bro. The sun tracks itself. It excels in a day. Come down, but they're asking uh, scientists. Well, to do scientists to do this to actually track with their phones so they can take uh, pictures of times of the sun and, and try to you know map the sun out, man. Because yeah, we we, we, we know that. we know through through the process of time through the through the waking awakening the truth that we understand that this dude is all this dude Esau this devil he's about all about analytics he's all about numbers and numbers. data yeah. and collecting and collecting information at a at, at a rapid pace, man. All right, because he ultimately want to do what he wants to be the most high, man. He wants to know the inner workings of how these 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 planets, these stars, the moon, how everything works, man. All right, that's why he sends his his, his scientists, the archaeologists, he, all all around the world. They got these motherfuckers are everywhere, man. They all in all in uh Australia, Antarctica. They doing their thing, you know. I got a little more. Yeah, go ahead. Luke twenty one and twenty five. And that should be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars and upon the earth distress of nations. With perplexing, mm -hmm. the sea and the waves warn. Man's heart failing them for fear and for looking after those things which are coming on earth, for the powers of heaven shall be shown. Mm -hmm. you, you finish off that, uh, that one real fast? Kind of. This is uh, back in 2nd Esther chapter 9, verse 3. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes, and uproars of the people in the world, mm -hmm. and what we're having right now. What's what's we what, what are we having right now in the world? All right, uproars of the people, man. You got you got wars breaking up. You got really they ain't talking about it, but you got Iran and you got Iran and Israel getting it on. They they shot missiles on each other, man. Yeah, yeah, another one. Yes. So we 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 had that we had that perfect. All right, if you had to, if, if this thing had to be cooking, if this had to be a pot of food that's cooking, we had we had that that medium level and and we seen the boil of the water now, man. All right, we there, man. Okay, and the Lord got this in the perfect thing or in the perfect position right now, man. All right. Oh, oh I'm gonna tell you what it is. Go down to Bob. We might stop at eight. Kind of, kind of. Well, get, what you had in Jeremiah? The, the, the be not just made of the signs. Yeah, get that real fast, and you get that Isaiah 29. Uh, Man, whatever y'all about got. What you got? Got Matthew 24. Okay, we'll get that too. This is Matthew chapter, uh, no, Jeremiah chapter 10, verse 1. Hear ye the word which Yahweh speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith Yahweh, learn not the way of the heathen. Out the gate, learn not the way of the heathen. Which you know our people have spelled miserably. They they learn and and go sort it sort out of the ways of the heathen, man. They want to be the heathen. All right. Go ahead. And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, mm -hmm. for the heathen are dismayed at them. What are the signs of heaven? The solar eclipse, shooting stars. All right. Uh, blood moons, super moon. The devil's comet. What's the other? What's the other damn thing, thing, man? Uh, out there, I think out there the brother be showing it sometimes. Out there in uh, Alaska. Alaska, you got you got the, the sky be green. Aurora borealis. Yeah, they just made it there, man. You got people that travel uh, far and wide just to go sit there. Like we got, we got, I got, I got an asshole in my job, man. A hippie. All right, this nigga said he's gonna leave. He's gonna leave a week and a half of work just to go to to some mountain. In uh, in, in uh, Illinois, to sit up there and meditate 
as the, as the solar eclipse come in. Raji, Rumba, this niggas is crazy, man. You know, but they, they but the heating are just made at this, man. And they make and guess what? They make they make medallions out of this. They make T-shirts. They they really are uh, 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 bugged out behind these behind the. The sun, I thought that was a, somebody else, boy. I'm about to go off. Oh. They're going to make merchandise of it, too. Uh, yeah. They're getting, they're getting pictures to sell. And, oh, yeah. they, do you know? They're selling the glasses. They're right? selling the glasses. Yeah. Before you can look at it. Yeah, it's a come up. Like, yeah. It's a come up for them. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. That was it on that for the Jeremiah. Yeah, go ahead. Isaiah, get that back in. God, it's the book of Isaiah, chapter 29, verse 6. It says, Thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts with thunder. Yeah, this is how the Lord visits the earth, man. He visits the earth with, with, with thunder. You're right. That's, that's how the Lord visits this place. All right, go ahead. It says, And with earthquake. And with earthquakes. And what's been happening? Earthquakes. And I'm going to say this too. Whether Esau is manipulating with the different heart machines and shit like that or not. It's still, it's still a visitation of the Lord, man. Right. He called it to happen. He put it on the mind of this devil to go prank that motherfucker up, man. I'm gonna do an eight point. I'm doing eight point four today. You know, this nigga be trying to break records, high scores with that bitch, man. You know. You mind if I get a piece of just the back of that statement you just made? You got right? some. You got some more. It was just the back of the statement that it's ultimately through the will of the Lord. It's Jeremiah fourteen and twenty two. Are there any among the vanities of the Gentiles that can cause rain, harp, these different type of instruments? Or can the heavens give showers? Art not thou he, O Yahweh, our power? Therefore we will wait upon thee, for thou hast made all these things. Yeah, he has made all those things to happen, man. And, and through his visitation. That's why we're not we're not tripping. You know, I, I watched this shit. You got them, you got them, you got them niggas over there in Taiwan, they in the cubicles. All right, they got the little, the little cat. Uh, what do you call it? No, no, the, the, the bobblehead head cat on the, on the, on the cubicle doing this, and that bitch shaking, man. All right, you know, and the, that, that, that's the Most High. All right, the Most High causes to happen, man. Go ahead. Uh, it says, uh, it says, I read the topic in this says, God shall be visited of the Lord of hosts with thunder and with the earthquake and Great noise with the storm and tempest and the flame of the violent fire. Yeah, the flame of the violent fire. Where, where most times the, the flame of the violent fire happen at? Over there on the west on the west coast That's with cool. those yeah. with those uh, forest fires. Yeah. You've been having a lot of them. The volcanoes <clears throat> yeah, volcanoes <throat> erupting. That's all the vegetation of the Lord, man. Burning this place up. High winds, tornadoes, hurricanes. That's the, that's the Lord, man. You know? We, we all for it. If I can say, I'm just reading an article on uh, Los Angeles Times, and it says that uh, Taiwan just experienced the, the largest, it says the strongest on the island in 25 years. Yeah. Uh, he, uh, um, Turkey. That one in Turkey killed what, 55,000 people? Oh, yeah. 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 I'm going to say this too. You know, a lot of brothers out there don't know, man, when you, you know, and it's through the years of studying, you know, the different the different situation with Esau with the heart. If you birds ever go outside, all right, after they, after they had like some type of rain or a storm, go look at the pattern. If you see those clouds are patchy, like you'll see a patch of clouds or space, it's like a it's like a, a ripple. Yeah. He didn't use that machine, man. You know, these devils use that machine, and that's what they do. You know, all these rains and shit, they don't. They just don't happen. When they, when they, they got a lot of shit going on with the, with the chemtrails. When they be spread, it, then the next, what happens two, three, three days later, a heavy storm comes through. Yeah. But, they, but they're, they're manipulating, they've been manipulating the weather for, for ages, man. Okay, I'll give you something. Go ahead. That's what the word halt means. It's the high frequency active auroral research program. It's a university that will last the Fairbanks program, which researches the iron sphere. Let me. I, the iron ionosphere, yeah, ionosphere, yeah. which is the part of the upper atmosphere of Earth. Yeah, what, what's doing, what they're doing, 
it's sending a high frequency up in the sky, and it and it and it mirrors and come back down and shoots in the ground, and it, and it basically lets off a vibration of whatever they want. They want an earthquake to happen, they can do it. They it's want to say that. It's yeah, go ahead. It says from about well above sea level, the region that includes the thermosphere and parts of the mesosphere and the exosphere. The ionosphere is ionized by solar radiation. It plays an important role in the atmospheric electricity and forms the inner edge of the mag magnetosphere. And what and what that atmosphere what 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 deals with what 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 happens to what happens to activate magnetics? It, it's about a second. Metals. It is so radio. It's like, that's, that's why they fly them planes and they, they put barium, they put aluminum, they put these different metals in there to what? It's like it's like it's like uh, my man Magneto. He can't do nothing unless it has to be what? Done with a metal. metal. So that's why they put metal in the atmosphere. So they can manipulate clouds. They can make rains and storms and tornadoes, whatever they want to do, man. And there's small particles of it. All right? Go ahead. Yeah. And like he said, the devil's got the knowledge of that. Working at what? From the left hand side, man. Yeah. Using what? Uh, um, all type of sorcery on it. You know, like. Obviously, at the end of the day, you gotta have the knowledge to be able to do some of these things, man. They got the wise men, the Germans, and the, you know those men. And it says it plays an important role in the atmospheric electricity. It forms the inner edge of the magnetic sphere. It has practical importance because, among other functions, it influences radio propagation, propagation. Propagation. Propagation to distant places on the earth. It also affects the GPS signals that travel through this layer. So yeah. even manipulate the, uh, the the distance and what you know, like the GPS and where it's going. So you can, when you know how to manipulate the elements, you can control where you send it at. Uh-huh. Don't the Lord say, "Thou send this lightning," and it says, "Here am I," because He's what He's the creator of the elements, man. So if you got the knowledge of that, you can manipulate it, man. And we gonna do it, you know. <coughs> you gotta do all Yagana. Yeah, this devil, he knows that man through his different and righteousness, though. Yeah. yeah, through his different magi, yeah, and, yeah. And, and, and witches and warlocks, he has the ability to do that, man. Yeah. Because what we know for sure that Satan is dealing with him, man. Mm-hmm. All right, Satan, Satan, the spiritual demon Satan is dealing with the so-called white man on the left hand level, man. All right, to be the witch and the warlock that he is, man. All his knowledge don't come from out of nowhere. All right, all this knowledge doesn't just fall in your lap. All right, you he gained power. The so called white man gained the power of this world through what the sorcery and witchcraft. All right, and through the and really the most high gave it to him too that's right. to do it. All right, that's why he that's why he plays with this world like a playground, man. All right, you know, Matthew, yeah, Matthew. Uh, Matthew. This is, uh, okay. yeah. Saint Matthew. Chapter 24, verse 4. It says, And Yahushua answered and said unto them, Bread, let us Yahushua speak, and now take heed that no man deceive you. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am a Mashiach, and shall deceive many. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Hey, the book the end is not yet. And we are we are very much at the end, all right? Just like we always talk about, you coming around that, if you ever ran track, you ran the 400 or so, or you ran the 200. Once you come around that last final curve, it's over with, man. And we in the last couple of meters of this thing. You can see the, you can see the, 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 the tape and everything, man. All right? Yeah, you gotta go all out, you know? Cause this devil's finna go all out on a, on a large level, on a large scale. He's finna wild out on you Americans. He's in the wild on, on the on the nations of the world, man. All right, they got more than that, right? Kind of, kind of. Uh, verse seven. It says, "For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places." Which which Taiwan is a diverse place. All right, you don't. It's, it's not. It's not uh, very uh, common to see an earthquake in Taiwan, man. All right. And we had, like I say. This other, what, what, what the other thing was? Oh, now you got all of a sudden you got all these ships running into different uh, bridges, man. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And really, Esau is doing what? He's he's destroying 
the uh, the logistics of the of the uh, of this of this country, man. The supply chain in this country is in a chokehold right now. All right, and he's purposely doing it. Like I said in the, in the past video, you know, we're gonna see in the next couple of weeks, months, or uh, you know, Lord, Lord forbid, year, why they why that bridge had to come down. All right, and I had the name. I had the name of that ship and that ship that ship name uh d-a-h-i goes back to demon man I think it was Dolly. Dolly. yeah and it goes back to it goes back to a demon and these devils do everything off of, uh numerology they do everything off uh the manipulation of words all right and that's that's what we do we're dealing with a full-blown sorcerer man all right six people died all right yeah. on the six on the six yeah. you know seven, the six. yeah yeah you know and then like i said a lot of this shit looks bullshit to me anyway because i seen three birds fly and then just disappeared like they were flying and just disappeared the bridge when you look at the bridge the bridge looks like a damn because i deal with that shit with computers it looked like a uh a green screen so yeah. you look at the boat the light go off two times but they got 18 wheels with just flying across that bit I'm like damn, they must got that in uh, uh, uh two times or three times. Yeah. But it's talking about it's, it's in it's in slow it's in it's in uh live time. I'm like, ain't no way 18 wheeler going from here to here at that speed. At that speed, yeah. man. Yeah. But yeah, we was, dealing with the devil, you know. I was gonna say nobody, no cars that was on the bridge. You don't hear about no cars mm -hmm. that fell off the bridge. Yeah. The 18 wheelers, nothing. It's just. Six oh, construction work. Six construction hey, where the people that was on the boat though? And guess what? The Who six interviewed the people on the boat? Huh? The six construction <laughs> workers are uh, migrants. Migrants. <laughs> the whole fucking job was so-called migrants. You know? Was it captain training? Yeah, it's, it's just bullshit, man. Then, then you put the article in there earlier that said they got four boats stuck that handles out with national defense. Yeah. At the back, they just can't get out. Yeah, man. <laughs> so it's just going to affect the national defense now. Like, it's like, come well, on. something man. about to happen. Something about to happen. I guess they can't get the weapons to them or whatever. You know. Yeah. So you're telling me if something break out right now, those ships can't even go out they, the wall. Yeah, they can't go out the wall. Yeah. All right. Hey, if I could, go ahead. If I could say, you know, what Esau's doing through. right now is what Esau does when he invades a country. It's, he, he bombs the bridges, he destroys the food processing plants, the communication, but Esau can't just come out and bomb US citizens with fighter jets, so what's he doing? Using different means to take out communications, take out bridges, food processing plants, and make it look like an accident. And you have people You have people that come out that was around that region and say they heard explosions, man. First hand. You know, I, I watched a dude slow this video down the, the, the bridge start coming down before the ship even before hit that bit. Yeah. All right, you see those, you see those, uh, the the, yeah, the explosions, man. And what they use a lot of time, what these elites use, because they use it on, the, they use it on the World Trade Center. It's called, you can go look it up. It's called nanomite. If you did anything in construction, anything with uh, demol uh demolition, nanomite burns through thick steel like butter, and you it got no traces of it either. Once they light it, that's it. You ever heard? Y'all probably heard of uh, 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 thermite. Thermite. You can buy thermite from Academy, but it's it's like a it's like it's like a, a quick implosion, but it don't have the effects of uh, shrapnel and all that shit. It just make the boom sound, you know. But that, but that's what you're dealing with with this devil, man. All right. And what the Lord got him? The Lord got him running ships <laughs> and shifts into uh, bridges and shit, man. Hey, and uh, you know, Richie from Boston made a beautiful point. What's the start and what's the incident that kicks everything off and leave the world behind? The ship, the that ship, ship it's navigation it getting mussed up and hitting the hitting the beach. Yeah, so Barack Hussein Obama been telling you the truth, man. That black we, magic too. Yeah, that black magic. We, we look at magic on repeat. You brothers, you brothers better be prepared because, like I said, I dealt with some shit the other night. What the sky was just tripping, yeah, man. Just flicking yeah, colors, yeah, pinks. I'm talking about <laughs> bright pinks, blues. Right, you like I said, we who knows this devil might for this eclipse, the devil might turn the lights off, man. For a few days, for, for a few days, weeks. Put that warning out that you may lose, you know, internet and, and phone signals. So brothers gotta be, you know, brothers gotta be prepared, man. You know. Yeah, they say stack up food and yeah, money yeah. and brother, cancel any appointments. Whenever we ever had to do these, make these type of arrangements for a solar eclipse, man. Right? That is declaring states of emergency. The states of emergency. Mm -hmm. What are y'all yeah. doing? So something about to go down, man. You know, anybody got anything else? I got a little bit more than that. 
Oh yeah, go ahead. Um, you better get out of here. We're gonna anybody got else? You want any more? This is uh, second as nine. Uh, yeah, Saint Matthew chapter twenty-four verse. Uh, it says, "All these are the beginning of the sorrows. Then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted, and shall kill you, and you shall be hated for all nations for my name's sake." And that's a possibility of happening, man. Right. Because because the truth sake, they're gonna want to take us up to these these high these higher level, all right, uh, big wigs, man. The governor of this state, the, the different mayors, the, even possibly whoever the president is gonna be, or whoever. All right, the elites behind the scenes, they're gonna to want to take us up to them and be visited them, man. Hey, you know you made my life a living hell by going on the corner telling the truth. All right. They're gonna to want to kill us, man. Are they gonna they gonna you know and possibly kill some of us, man? For the for for the sake of your house shot. Skeet on the camera. <laughs> so that's, this shit is getting ridiculous, man. It said in the next verse, uh last verse right here, chat uh, verse ten. It says, and then shall many be offended and shall betray one another and shall hate one another. Yeah. <clears throat> Shit, this is already happening, man. All right? Hey, hate and hate in America is at an all-time high, man. It's just people haven't locked horns yet, you know? Race riots are happening. Race riots are going to happen in America, whether you like it or not. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn if uh, uh, Cody, Jeff, or whoever the fuck you love that, of, the, of, the, of the other color, you gonna lock horns with them damn devils, man. You are right, you Jakes in America. Even you got them, you Latinos, you so-called Latinos. You you gonna lock horns with this white boy, man. All right, that's a part of prophecy. All right, according to the Bible, according to the Yahweh Shem Shad, man. All right, we just in those times. Anything we in a time right now where anything can bust out the seams anytime, any place, anywhere, man. All right. And why you got to be prepared, man. Your faith need to be at, at an all-time high, man. You shouldn't be shook when you start to see things and, and things start to happen right before your eyes, man. Right, I just said after the Passover, the Lord going to turn it up, man. Yeah. It's 2024. It's the year of Jacob's trouble. Yes. You, you got to act like that's that's so, man. <laughs> you need to act like it's Jacob's trouble every day. Every day. You shouldn't be out here slipping. Yeah. All right? You shouldn't be out here slipping. You should be, act, you should be acting and simulating Jacob's trouble right now, man. When I'm going home, I ain't going home the same way I came to the spot I just came. I'm going another way. You need to be learning how to navigate these goddamn streets, man. Without a GPS. Without a GPS. This all this all muscle memory, man. And like I said, you don't want to go there on that survival tip because you know how Jake get, you know, but you need you brothers need to be on point. Okay, at least at least if I needed to use this bitch to get somewhere, my car kind of full. Jake, you should be running a car down to that bitch empty. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> you know? And don't be with no drawers on, Jake. <clears throat> Jake like a, you sleeping butt ass naked and the world ended outside, man. You know? You, you done left the world behind for real. You yeah. hit real time. Yeah. Uh, I want to end on I'm a wild boy. Okay. Mine's panic too. That was that on the bathroom. Well, it ended on you, man. We can eat it live out here. This uh, is the book of Joel, chapter 2, verse 30. You can break it down too, bro. It says, And I will shoot wonders in the heavens and in the earth, mm -hmm. blood and fire, and pillars of smoke. Ooh. The sun shall be turned into darkness, in which you had a sun that's literally is going to be the, the, the day is actually going to change to darkness with this uh, solar eclipse with the sun being blocked out. It says, and the moon into blood, which we've been seeing the signs of the blood moons. That's right. Right, from previous years all up until now, all right? It says, and the moon into blood before the great and terrible day of the Lord come. So as the elder been going into, man, all the signs are here. All the signs that the, the Bible spoke of, these end time prophecies, everything is here. And we just one step away from everything being officially kicked off, man. That's right. Yeah, yeah man. Huh? Got one last one to back up what he was saying. All right. It's uh, the book of Sirach, chapter 43 and verse 6. And it reads, he made the moon also to serve in her season for a declaration of time and a sign of the world. Hey, pretty much to back up what that brother was saying. All right, the moon not just that. It looked good in the sky for, you know, these different heathen to make idols out of, you know, necklaces and things like that. No. 
if the moon has an actual purpose, okay, is to declare time to show you when 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 a season is ended and when a new one is beginning, all right, for you to actually uh, uh, keep time. You get the word month from the word moon. You see? But uh, I just want to back that brother up. And the new, and I'm gonna say this too: the sun actually tells the time and the day. That's if you right. know how to, if you know how to read it, all right. When it's dawn or it's just coming over the peak, you can tell. Oh, it's it's five, six o'clock. By the time you get it right here, you can say, oh, it's eight, it's nine, mm -hmm. it's it's twelve o'clock at, at high noon. Yeah, 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 it's the highest in the yeah. sky. Three o'clock right. is yeah. over here. In the sky, yeah. You should better, you know, and the brother should brother it's should know that, set. man. Yeah. Where's true north? True north is straight up. All right. That's why you can tell you can tell where the heavens at. True north is to the heavens, man. You have north. East, south, east, west, man. Look at shadows. Every tree is a sundial. Look at where the shadows are. Right. Give you directions too. Yeah, man. It's rising east. <coughs> no, what is it? Rising east. Rising west. That's in the west. Yeah, That's yeah, in the west. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you can. Right. You should be able to tell what time it is. That's how when Lord coming too. Yeah. When Lord gonna come from the east. east. From the east. That's right. Yes. That's, right, brother. That's how we gonna get up out of here. You gotta know that direction. You gotta go. <coughs> right. And the same thing with Yahweh Shai is a, is a, is a he's a, a, a what you call it? You just said it. A sundial. Yahweh Shai is a sundial because we in that what hour? The 11 hour of it finished strike 12, man. Right. When he come back. All right. We didn't got all the other, the, the, the whole uh, day, two, three days out the way. The Lord is finna come back, man. All right. The Lord is finna come literally make his appearance on, on this planet Earth, man. All right, so we hope this, this this lesson was edifying to the point, all right, through the spirit, as we always do. We're going to end it out by saying, uh, giving all praise to glory and honor to you. Once again, double honors to the elders, apostles of GMS, teaching blessing and citations once again to the hopefully elect. Until next time, Shalom. 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 Baba 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 Baba